A home invasion and shooting in Tempe near Mill Avenue and the 60 and the suspects are still on the loose. And Fox 10's Marissa Sarbach spoke with one of the victims who is hoping the public and the ring doorbell footage can help catch those who terrorized them. Mark, Christina, we are told this happened around 1 o'clock on Monday morning. Tempe police not confirming too much on this case right now, but they are confirming that there was a home invasion and a shooting. Now, the victim's sister happens to live next door and captured part of this on her ring doorbell camera. She's just hoping at this point they can catch whoever's responsible. He's hanging in there. He's in a lot of pain today and they're just, you know, trying to keep him comfortable as much as possible. Melinda Fairbanks says her brother Louie was shot three times in his legs in that home invasion. Melinda lives a few doors down from Louie and his girlfriend Megan. She heard the gunshots ring out. It was Melinda's ring doorbell that captured the men on camera right before they broke into Louie and Megan's home. So scary. Lately in Tempe, it's just been so scary. Megan didn't want to go on camera today, but tells us when three armed men broke into their townhouse, they demanded jewelry and cash. My brother noticed that their roommate had an Alexa in the room, so he said, Alexa, call 911. And then um, the robbers heard him, so he, they asked, who are you calling and why are you calling? Megan says that's when one of the men aimed his gun at Louis's head and pulled the trigger. She says the gun jammed, giving Louis a chance to fight back. I was choking him, and then the other robber shot my brother in the leg, and then one time on one leg and twice on the other leg. And Melinda and Megan say detectives on scene told them they are investigating another home invasion in the same area from a week ago, but Tempe police have not confirmed another incident to Fox 10. Megan and Melissa are hoping someone will come forward with information leading to an arrest while Louis recovers. She's just trying to recuperate now. We're just grateful that he's still alive. We are told Louie is recovering at Banner Desert in Mesa. Anyone with information on this home invasion is asked to call Tempe police. Reporting live in Tempe, Marissa Sarbach for Fox 10 News. Marissa, thanks.